outside Irving. Another three for Dallas. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five makes are from beyond the arc. It's hard for me to watch this. I mean, the defense practically giving them those shots. Definitely a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look. Green taking his time here. Back to Irving. This is a direction to take the lead. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Pass to Tillman. Pass to Pritchard. Horford with the screen on Washington. Pritchard from the top of the key. He buries it. And the Celtics lead by one. Neither team here in the fourth generating a lot of separation. Yeah, it's been a close one. Five times the lead has switched hands thus far. Here's Irving. And another basket for Dallas. And he has just been in a flow offensively. Terrific game. He has been the X factor. And there's the pass to Tatum. Passes it to Horford. And finished off by Horford. Jason Tatum scores, but also creates for his teammates a sign of his continuing growth as a player. Dallas has gone two for two from three-point land to start the fourth quarter. Outside Irving. Three pointer. Tillman grabs the miss. You know, he's just chucking it up from distance this quarter. If you're going to do this, especially in the second half, you better make them. Here's Pritchard, covered by Irving. Unloads from 13. A shot by Pritchard, no good. The Mavericks trailing. Just over two and a half minutes played now here in the final quarter of regulation. Now, here's Washington. He's guarded closely, and the shot goes in. Proving he can capitalize from this area, too. Washington being assertive and looking to score. I like it. Outside Tatum. Pass to Pritchard. Tries to the hoop. Got a hand on it. How the Mavericks moving it up. Here's Washington, and then Washington with the dunk. Well, we're going to see lots of those. Washington can really get up. He's got a little main streak in him, too, which I like. Now, here's Tatum. Tight defense on him. And the shot is good. The man that has been cut down to just one on the bucket from Tillman. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind the layup. Come on now. Irving can't get it to go. The Celtics have gone 4-7 for the field since the beginning of the fourth. Inside, Tatum! And they're passing the ball very crisply here. The Mavericks have gone five of seven from the field since the beginning of the fourth. Strong work at that end of the floor. Dallas calls timeout. And the Mavericks will go for a different look here. And the wait is now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Thanks, guys. Well, I got a chance to listen in on what Jason Kidd was talking about with his players. He told them this is what it's all about, proving we're the better team in the tough situation. But you got to want it. Coach told his guys they have what it takes to win here. Guys, back to you. Thank you, David. And out of bounds as the Celtics gain possession. And now let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. It's a different kind of defense teams play in the postseason. Much more intense, more in your face. High energy plays like that one are winning plays. Here's Holiday. Outside Tatum. Now 
Outside, Brzingis, a three ball. It's rebounded by Dallas. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that position. And Doncic throws it down. Get used to seeing this, folks. Doncic taking the moment head on and delivering. And here is Brown. Buries the long-range jumper. Brown's got 13 points here in the second half alone. He made three triples in the first half, three more since then. I tell you what, you can't shake your head at that. Doncic passes to Irving. Back to Doncic. Outside Hardaway. Just five to shoot. Nice hit again. Offered his screen on Brown. Hardaway passes to Gafford. And that one, good. Gafford's got it all tied up now for the man. And you don't want to allow too many of those short ones with the game right now in the balance. Right side, Holiday. Brown outside. Nice ball movement by Boston. They get it again. For Dallas, they've gone 7 of 10 shooting the ball since the start of the fourth quarter. Doncic kicks to Gafford. Irving double team. Here's Doncic. Count and he'll have a chance for a three point play. That one is on Holiday. Tell you what, guys, that's not an easy finish, but somehow Doncic makes it look rather effortless. situations. Kleba against Tatum. And there are the Celtics with another basket. And Tatum has been in these situations before. He's reliable when it comes to stepping up in big moments. Produced green on Hubbard. Here's Dunshin. The kick out to Irving from the arc. Sinks the three-pointer. Irving's got eight points in the quarter. Boy, you need a confident player to get you a big bucket. And that's exactly who Irving is and what he does. Tatum against Kleber. A shot. And the shot is good. The Maverick has been cut down and gets two points with the bucket from Tatum. He's such a clutch shooter. He just lives for the big shot. Holiday against Dodger. Stolen by Holiday. Here's White. Yes! And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. Well, that was one, too. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. 56 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Moving against White. Pass to Dodger. It's deflected. Taken away by Holiday. From 18 feet away, it falls! Hey, and with Brown, guys, it doesn't matter what point in the game it is. I mean, he's ready to shoot whenever he has the ball in a good spot. Dallas calls timeout. They're down by two. 40 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Leases one from three. Lucas' peripheral vision off the chart. Get wide open, and he's going to find you. Now a timeout called by Boston. They're trailing by one. 32 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. 
Tatum wide open. He fires one. It's good. And Tatum continues to evolve before our eyes, showing excellent leadership by knocking down these clutch shots. Dallas calls timeout. They trail by one. 26 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Twenty-six seconds left to play in the final quarter. Holiday against Doncic. Kleba with a screen on Holiday. And here's Doncic from the arc. The three won't fall. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now. Again and again, they're not in the penalty yet. Yeah, you, you have to do that, though. You can't just let them dribble the game. Exactly. I mean, you got to stop the clock any way possible. And hope they alligator arm a few of those free throws. He hits the first one, and that will put them up by two. And Holiday doesn't get easily rattled. He has a calm personality that helps him in big moments. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a three-point game. Big-time free throws there. That could be the difference. It forces them now into a three-point attempt. Yeah, he's got a great motor, Hardaway Jr. He does not need to be pushed to step up in big moments. He relishes it. Now a timeout called by Boston. Six seconds left in the fourth. Brown inside the line. Got it! It seems like Brown always has something cooking. And he shows up big when they need him more. And so it's Boston stepping by with the win.